I sort of hope that the public pressure will sway the justices before a final opinion comes out. Um, but if it doesn't, I mean, there's so many things, you know, we can advocate at the state level. Um, I'd really prefer that abortion remain a constitutional right. It's health care. I don't think the government should be getting in between anyone and their doctors. Like every, every facet of our society you go to, we don't really have the power or a voice. So I just think it's crazy that nine people have the final say on like everything in the country and they can never lose their job. It just seems weird. I was actually surprised at how radical the opinion was. I think we all suspected that the court would overrule or at least undermine Roe versus Wade. But this opinion actually sets back constitutional jurisprudence or constitutional law for two or three generations. This completely ignores the reality of women's lives. It erases the reality of women's lives. And it, I'm not surprised, but I'm extremely upset. It's devastating. Honestly, I doubt that many people are gonna take that seriously. Um, what do you mean by that? As in, women gonna do what they gotta do. And I'm for it. And it, I'm not saying that you know, you got to go under the table and get these things done because without being in a, um, a clean space while getting this thing done can be more f um, neg negatively effective. I'm sorry. Um, I think it's just, it has nothing to do with us. It has nothing to do with the world. A woman's body has nothing to do with the world. It shouldn't be an opinion of others. Because uh, I believe that every woman has to have the right to have, uh, to say, uh, how to say, on, on her body. Not, nobody has the right to decide over the woman's bodies.